about to take a long on DIYS. Had a big old gap bit here. Uh, carried on going up. Got some sideways action. Now looking like he's heading north again. This is INFN on the NASDAQ. Looking to take a short. Big old gap down here. Oh, short thousand there at 961. As I was saying, big old gap down here. Had a little bit of sideways action. Not really been able to do anything. And uh, looks like it's going to drop off again. So short on INFN. Going to take a little long on APWR. Had some nice, uh, nice movement there yesterday afternoon, evening towards the end of the session. Now a lot of people like to trade uh, towards the end of the session, especially in the UK when uh, that's in the evening for you after work. And you see, you get some lovely moves up like this. Nice, easy trade that was. To uh, could have got uh, at least fifty cents a dollar out of that. Anyway, after a little bit of sideways, this is uh, now looking like it's ready to make a bit more of a move upwards. So just waiting to time the entry on this one. Just keeping an eye on the old Duff chart indicators. Alright, that's looking good. Just gone in there at 27.50. Okay, so back on DRYS. Uh, long here from 82.57 now up uh, well over a dollar. So looking to close half of this out. Lock in some of that profit. It's pretty volatile. I'm moving around quite quickly. Would like to. Uh, would like to get about five hundred in the bank out of this. Oh, I just got filled out eighty three sixty three, which has put five hundred and thirty dollars in the bank, and uh, leaves me long five hundred still to uh, run that one a little bit longer and see what happens with that one. All right, going to close out the other half for DRYS. This ain't really uh, doing it for me at the moment. Came out there 83.04 the second half on that. So we're just uh, $235 on there. Could have gone either way, could have kept going up. May still keep going up, but uh, it's getting started to get a bit late in the day, getting on for 11 o'clock. So we're starting to close out some of these positions. Okay, so back on APWR. Looking to uh, close this out now. It's moving up nicely, but uh, it's gone 11 o'clock, getting a bit bored. And uh, got other things to be doing today. So uh, we're long here from 27.50 down here somewhere. And uh, this has put on a nice little move upwards. Got stuck around here for a little while, but uh, it's carried on going. Still going up at the moment. Uh, time on the exit, try and get as much as we can, but without hanging around too long. Going to come out here. Came out 28.27, just get filled on that for uh, $770, so we're uh, quite happy with that. Right, so that just leaves me with INFN, short from uh, 9.61. Never really did anything. This one's just been going sideways. Going to come out, take a one cent loss on there, or a two cent loss with the spread. Cover that there. All right, just got filled there. Nine sixty three, so uh, just a two cent loss in the commission. So uh, loss for of about forty dollars, I suppose, if you add it all up. Thirty dollars, I think, with a commission. All right, so to summarise then. Uh, DIYS took a couple of uh, hits on that. First lot got out for uh, five hundred thirty dollars, and the second off. Unfortunately, didn't go back uh, to its previous eye, so I only took 235 on that. That's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes, isn't it? APWR, that one was all right, wasn't it? 770, that's uh, still going up at the moment, but uh, I haven't got time to be trading it, unfortunately. Caught past 11, I need to be uh, doing other things. And INFM, well, it was the old slow burner and uh, just never went anywhere, did it? Just lots of sideways on that. So we're uh, out for a little $20 loss on that. So uh, total profit on the day then of uh, $1,515, uh, which ain't too bad. But uh, as I say, loads of opportunity, loads of stuff moving today. The There's still a load of stuff going on. And uh, if I didn't have other things to be doing, then I would probably hang around and, uh, and take a bit more. But uh, trading, you know, it's only about uh, making a living. Uh, it's not the be all and end all. There's other things to do. So uh, I've got to go and spend some of this now. Alright then, uh, I know it's been a long time since I've uh, done a video but uh, been off on vacation and uh, 
obviously uh, had some computer problems the other week which I mentioned in an email so uh, between one thing and another uh, I know it's been a, been a little while but hopefully uh, next video will be along a bit quicker than, uh, than the delay since the last one. Alright, speak to you soon.